welcome to Sunflow Alwyn Stadium, the home of uh, Manchester Montoya Maga, for the final J1 game of the season. Um, today's game was set up to be a really big match, but um, sadly last weekend uh, Manchester Montoya Maga lost 4-1 uh, to Gamba Osaka, whereas the opposition today, Shonan Balmare, won 1-0 against Sanfrecce Hiroshima, which means Manchester Montoya Maga are relegated from J1. Um, so after one season they're going back to J2. But the opposition today, Sean and Belmare, are currently in the relegation playoff positions. If they win today, they will get out of the relegation playoff uh, because the two teams in 14th and 15th, I think, um, which are Sagan Tosu and Shimizu Espos are playing each other. So Shonan have a great chance to escape, which is amazing because they went 11 games without a win after their previous manager, uh, Cho Kui Jae, part of the company with the club after a um, power harassment scandal. Yeah, not good. But um, it should be a really interesting match. It's absolutely freezing, as you would imagine, because it's December in the mountains in Nagano Prefecture. But uh, this stadium is fantastic. The fans are amazing. So let's go and check out the stadium. So uh, despite being relegated last weekend, like I mentioned earlier, um, this game is a complete sellout. There were no seats available. Um, I had a seat. I did have a ticket to get a seat, but um, it's standing room only. Uh, there were no seats left somehow. So um, I'm standing at the back of the stand, and there was still 90 minutes to go until kickoff. Um, so yeah, it's going to be really wild today. It's definitely going to be a quite a lively farewell party, I think, to J1. Um, but the stadium is really cool. But one thing that it does lack, it has no roof. And and rain was forecast, but it's looking a bit brighter now, so hopefully I'll be okay. But I do have my poncho, just in case.
a uh, nil-nil. It's a bit of a cliche to say, but you can see why these two teams are near the bottom of the league. Um, not much has happened. The only chances really came from errors in the defence. Uh, in the other game uh, that matters today, it's uh, Espolos nil, Sagantosu nil. Um, and at the moment, uh, Belmare haven't done enough to get out of the playoff, uh, the relegation playoff. They need to win this game to get out. As it stands, they're going to be going to the relegation playoff, and Yamaga are going to end their season with a uh, goalless draw. Um, I think it will end nil-nil. I can't really see any quality in this game, sadly, and it's very cold as well. But I'm not going to complain about the weather because I feel like every game I go to, I complain about the weather. So it's fine. It could be worse. So uh, let's see what happens in the second half. Absolute madness. So, um, Shonan were out of the relegation playoff. They took the lead in the 85th minute. Then, uh, in the 90th minute, Mats Morto equalised and dragged Shonan right back into the relegation playoff. So, that's it for Shonan. They're going to play either Tokushima Vortis or. Um, oh, who's the other team? So that means Shonan are going to play either Tokushima Vortis or Montedio Yamagata, which means in that game Shonan only have to draw to stay up, but if they lose they'll be relegated and one of the other two teams who are playing tomorrow will be promoted into J1. But really, absolutely crazy scenes, it just nothing was happening and then suddenly it all came to life. Shonan, the fans, the players went absolutely mental, they thought they'd done it. But 
fair play to Yamaga, they've got nothing to play for, but they still kept battling, they dragged themselves back into the game. Mad, yeah, absolutely crazy. I feel sorry for Sean and really, I mean, to like the emotional drain of that. They've now got to pick themselves up and play the playoff. Uh, yeah, I worry for them, I think that could be tough. But uh, that's it from uh, Montedio. That's it from uh, Manta Monto Yamaga. It's really cold, so I'm going to go back to my uh, hotel. Um, but what a place to watch football. Really beautiful background with the mountains. The fans are incredible, they're so loud. It's a real loss to J1, I think, this team being relegated. Hopefully they'll be back in, in a few years' time. But next year they're going to light up J2, I'm sure. Well, the fans will, the team. Maybe not, but let's see. Uh, but fantastic experience. I love Nagano Prefecture. It's really beautiful, and the football is great. So thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, and if you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing for more ground hopping videos around Japan. So thank you very much. See you next time.